the best part that I like is the girls must be preparing for those questions at the end because they had, eventually everybody wants to become a winner and they must be learning a lot with that as well. We've got to take a very, very short break and after this short break, we will be wrapping up the show. You're watching South Asian Live. I'm your host, Yudhir Jaswa. Once again, the poll question for you. You can certainly give your comments. Do you think beauty pageants are help to the South Asian community? You can answer A, yes. You can answer B, no. Log on to rogerstv.com forward slash South Asian Live. Opinions expressed in the following program are those of the participants and do not necessarily reflect those of Rogers or Rogers TV. Welcome back to South Asian Live. I'm your host, Yudhvir Jaswal. You're watching South Asian Live and we have our two very special guests. This is the final segment. This will be a very short one. Tony Ji, welcome back. And uh, what are your future plans uh, about this uh, pageant? When are you going to, going to hold the next one? And also, if you may, uh, you know, tell your website as well. Okay. First of all, my website is www.canadian-pageants.com. Okay. So that's my website. And for the future, the next pageant, Right now, we are going for the international pageant that's going to happen in Dubai okay. in the month of June. June. So once we are done with that, then we are going to announce the new date. Right. But we already have, have the contestants so far, like we have four applications for the next year. Very good. And uh, when you go in Dubai, um, uh, is, is it only the contestant, the winner, she's going to go the, there? The winner. Yeah, because and she's going to represent Canada. She's going to represent Canada. And how many other contestants will be there? 40, to, total 41 countries. 40, 41 countries. Yeah. And do you have a contestant from states, uh, UK, no. Australia? Oh, yes, what I, yes, in the states, uh, they had their pageant in the month of November where she was the judge. Okay. Yeah. 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 She's going to represent US and Dubai. Okay. Yeah. And who do you think in the in the recent times, if you, if you've noticed, who, who which country has t taken away, you know, the, the maximum number of crowns? Well, you know what? In the, the I think this pa this pageant has been happening for years and years, and uh, there's been like, Canada. I don't think has ever bought it back. Or back in the 90s, they bought it back. And I want Canada to bring it this time. Are so you? that's what I'm hoping for. We're training Kajol. We have so much hopes in her because she's such a bright and intelligent girl. Right. So I'm pretty sure. 
and uh, we are, we are very much hopeful that she is going to yeah. get this one get this one you yeah. you yep. you're, you're very hope, much hopeful. very yeah. hopeful yeah. Yeah. you know what at an international level when it's miss world or miss universe yeah. i think venezuela their girls win a lot of titles and then we also have india also winning yes. i think especially after you know what ashwarya rai she won sushmita sen yes. then you had priyanka chopra uh, then you had so many other girls i think this this, this thing is picking up do you yeah. think this uh, this is one thing which is going to grow bigger and bigger in the south asian community yeah it's growing up it's, it's growing up, up. like say with this one for us being the first time hosting now we got so, so much of response that i really like there are contestants they they already started contacting us today also i i received one appeal so total like it's been one week only and we have four contestants with us for the next year yeah and uh, shreya your final thoughts if there are any contestants uh, watching this program or the parents your final thoughts what would you say to them you know what i am i personally just say follow your heart follow your dreams and you know what if you do want to make a difference in the community maybe you want to be a part of the entertainment industry we have set up a great platform to you so next year when we announce the day keep checking our website and come out and participate yeah tony ji and your final thoughts for all the parents if they are thinking whether their daughters should participate or shouldn't participate what are your final comments yeah i would say if they have any doubts in their mind they can always contact me and like this pageant basically the way we have done it it's going to be a, fa a family event and you can see the success of this pageant that we did it last week you can see the success of this page and thank you very much uh, in this week's edition of midweek newspaper so don't forget to pick your copy of midweek newspaper and kajol the winner the, her pictures are there hope uh, you enjoyed the, watching this show we'll be back next wednesday same time same channel thanks very much
for all the people of Toronto. And I'm sure Mayor McCallion and Mayor Fennell would appreciate a mayor of Toronto that can do that. Okay, and in a moment we will get Maria's reaction on how that may affect the uh, interaction uh, in Brampton. But right now we want to go to uh, Mississauga City Hall where uh, another uh, mayor, a mayoralty race is over, and Hazel McCallion is there standing by with Sangeeta Iyer. Sangeeta? Thank you, Brian. Right with me here is Mayor Hazel McCallion. Congratulations. How do you feel right now? I feel very good, very proud to uh, have the on great support in the citizens.